We have both just made our first investment of the year. And in 10 years of working together, this is only the second time we ever both bought on the same development. So what's so special about this one? I'll tell you what's special, that I'm allowed back on YouTube videos again. I mean, that's, that's, that's special enough, but this is a super special investment because obviously, as Rob said, we've both invested. And it's special because most people wouldn't invest right now. And I think that's really important as well, is that there's a lot of nervousness in the market so why on earth are we investing when so many other people are scared or just holding off? Well, the main reason, well, not the main reason, but a big reason is this location. Yeah, we're investing, not surprisingly, in one of our main hotspots for the year, Derby. We said when we picked these hotspots, this wasn't us just kind of picking some areas. These are the areas that we are going to be looking for for our clients and for ourselves. And so when this opportunity came up in Derby, obviously we we're going to get involved. Yeah, jumped right all over this one. It's a brilliant investment. Derby is so strong as an investment location. Well, it's so strong, let's tell you more about it. Okay, so there are three things we love about Derby as an investment location, and three things that we love about this investment in particular. Let's start with Derby. And the main thing that Derby's got going for it is employment. There are a huge range of local employers, major ones including Toyota, Rolls-Royce, and Valent, to name just three, in high-skill and high-wage sectors. You can feel really good about future rental and purchase demand because there are so many important employers there. This ties into the second thing to love, which is high average incomes. Residents of Derby earn about £200 a month more than the national average, but their cost of living is far below average. And the result of that is that they have more disposable income than anywhere else in the UK. This is obviously positive because it means that they're not gonna be struggling to pay their rents and there's the ability there and even the likelihood there for rents to rise. And the third positive is connectivity. Whether it's by train or road, Derby is in a fantastic location. That's part of the draw for all those employers. And that means that employers will continue to be attracted to the area and also means that you might end up with people choosing to make Derby their home, even if they have to travel to other locations like Nottingham for work. So those are the three big reasons that we made Derby one of our hotspots this year. But there are also three things that we love about the investment itself. And they're all linked into the quality of the development. One of the things we've learned about investing over the years is it's always good to have the best. If you have a premium product and supply of that product is limited, you tend to get growth earlier and that growth tends to be higher. This is tied into location as well. So if you combine those as we are here and getting the best product in the best location, that seems like a strong recipe for capital growth. The second positive is it should rent easily with no hassle. Again, people tend to want the best if they can afford it, which as we've heard in Derby, they can. And as a result, it should be really easy to find tenants and can be picky about the type of tenants, meaning that the hassle that comes from renting should be minimised. And the third thing is that as well as capital growth being strong, rental growth should be strong. As you can see, the development that we're buying in is really nice and there just isn't anything else like this in Derby. So you've got something that everyone wants, you've got people who are willing and able to pay for that quality and as a result there's a reason for rents to go up and there's the ability for rents to go up. And indeed, the rents on a previous phase of this specific development have already gone up by 15 to 20% since it completed about a year ago. That's above the national average and that's what we'd expect to happen. So we believe there's much further for rents to go as well. So that all sounds super awesome. But why now? Why are we investing right now? Because we've already said people are nervous. So why are we being what could be seen as bold? But one of the big things is, is that it's easy to get a good deal in this type of market. So yes, if the market softens a little bit more, then you could go, oh, boo-hoo us. But actually, we got a better deal because the market has softened. So we got a bigger discount. We negotiated harder. And we managed to get something we were super happy with. So if the market goes against us by a couple of percent, we can live with it. Yeah, and we're not buying with the aim of selling again in a year's time at a profit. So if you're going to be holding something for five years, 10 years, 20 years, then if you buy it at the exact right moment, it doesn't matter. If it ends up being worth 2%, 3%, 5% worth less at some point, it just makes absolutely no difference. And so when the right opportunity comes along in the right area, then of course, you've, you've got to do it. So for me, I've got no fear around the timing at all, but mortgages are the other thing people are going to be thinking about. Did that give you any kind of pause before going into this deal? Because obviously rates are so much higher and kind of uncertain about where they're going to be even by the time this completes. Yeah, but, but rents are really strong across the UK, but particularly in Derby. So I would expect rents a lot uplift to help. Of course, mortgage rates aren't as attractive as they were a year ago, but they are improving all the time. And by the time this completes, because there's a short off plan period, when it completes, I'd like to think that mortgages would have got even more competitive again. 
and we can get a better rate than today. There's something else that I remembered after recording that I forgot to mention, which is I talked a lot about the best, how good things happen if you have the best. Well, the amazing thing about this investment is the best doesn't even cost much. So it's pretty amazing. You've got something of this quality in this location that we're picking up for far below the average UK property price. So when we see the ability to buy something of this quality at such a low price that yields so well in a location that we believe in so strongly, that made it a really easy investment decision. So we're excited, we're invested, but where should you invest? Yeah, we love Derby, but we love some other areas as well. So watch our video on the best hotspots to invest in this year to find out our favorite investment hotspots for 2023.